More in our special look at local heroes. I'm Gloria Makarenko in Burnaby. Harry Hardy is the ultimate Mr. Fix-It. He designs and builds things to help people with disabilities live better lives. So this is your workshop. This is it. At almost 90, Harry Hardy has been volunteering since he retired. This is a workbench for a person in a wheelchair. And this is a stainless steel tray on, on a walker with a clothesline across the back so a lady can handle her kitchen duties. A mechanical engineer by trade, now he spends his time on building inventions that allow disabled people to be more mobile. <laughs> Good to see you. You too. <laughs> Today, he has a lunch date at the local Legion. Heather McCain was losing the use of her arms caused by arthritis. So pop up the tree. So, Harry designed and built a folding tray that takes the pressure off her body. And it's all set for me to rest my arms on. We definitely uh, made the project a lot longer <laughs> than, uh, than necessary, but uh, it was great to spend the time with Harry. Harry's built a life based on duty, one of Canada's few surviving World War II air aces. Being shot down on Christmas Day in 1944? It seems crazy now when we're this old that we would have done all those things we did then. But when you're there, it's nothing. Harry may say it's nothing, his service then, his volunteer work now, but to the people he helps, he's a hero. So far, 285 devices for all kinds of different disabilities. He's proud of what he's done, but he's concentrating more on what he's about to do and the projects that are coming up. And uh, there's no slowing down Harry. <laughs> I'm aiming to finish 300 while I'm still on this side of the grass. You've had a very full life, Harry. Pretty well. <laughs> yeah, pretty well. Yeah. How, how would you describe it? Uh, well, Probably useful, you know, always doing something rather than just bumming around. Far from bumming around, he's a man who gives gifts all year long, things that bring real joy to those who receive them.